Children's Hospital is known, of course, for top-level health care for children. Well, now it's looking to merge with another children's hospital here in Southern California. Fox 5's Jason Sloss is live at Rady Children's with more about this plan. Jason. Yeah, we're talking about a plan for a merger with Rady Children's Hospital and Children's Hospital of Orange County. Today we heard from Rady's CEO who says this merger, this merger will expand access to health care along with hopefully leading to new treatments and cures. A merger with Rady Children's Hospital and Children's Hospital of Orange County is in the works. A deal that would put Rady's in the top five of Children's Hospital networks in the U.S. This is a big deal. It's all about the kids. Rady Children's Hospital CEO and President Dr. Patrick Frias says the two organizations have had an ongoing affiliation for about a decade. We collaborate so well together. The cultures are very aligned. He says Rady and Children's Hospital of Orange County would merge under the name of Rady Children's Health, each continuing to operate with their own staff and governing boards. For the patients that come here, nothing will change. The access that you have, if anything, will improve. Frias says along with access, the merger will lead to other enhancements for children's health care in San Diego and throughout Southern California. This will provide more opportunities for clinical research, translational research, and really finding the cures and treatments for kids in the next generation. He adds the merger will help achieve those goals by also attracting top health care workers. A lot of the kids we care for have rare disease and unique disorders, and, and you know, pediatric care providers, some, some specialties are very hard to recruit for. So as you serve a, a broader patient base, it allows that opportunity to be able to recruit and retain some of the best and the brightest in some of those areas. We're told discussions about a possible merger started about a year and a half ago. Uh, there are still regulatory hurdles to get over to make this happen, but Freya says he doesn't expect any problems. And so when this goes through, it will likely take effect sometime next year. Live at Rady Children's, Jason Sloss, Fox 5 News.